Don't mind me, I'm just cleaning out my closet. What am I gonna do with all these? Ninja? Captain Sedona will save the day. Yar, matey. Ah, shirt monster. Oh, I can make these into a t-shirt yarn too, toy for Fluffy. But first, intro finger dance. Here's what you're gonna need for the project. Some old t-shirts, a pair of scissors, that's it. Wait, that's really it? That's all. For shirt selection, you're gonna wanna keep a couple things in mind. One, use different colored shirts so it makes the braid nice and pretty and colorful and bright. Two, you don't wanna use shirts with labels on them because the labels get all crunchy when you try to braid and it just doesn't turn out as well. To make the chew toy, take your plain t-shirt and just lay it down on a flat surface. Now, take your scissors and cut along the top of the seam of the bottom of the shirt and across the shirt right under the armpits. Done, now you have a square that's easy to work with. Now, fold the closed end to the other closed end, leaving about one inch at the top. Then, taking your scissors, cut one inch strips all the way up past the folded fabric. Oh, mittens, if you were a lion, this would be so much easier. <laughs> done! And once you're done cutting, it should look like a grass skirt. Or a beard. Now, open it up, and you'll see a spine. Take the first bottom slit and cut it out. Now you can just cut from slit to slit. Now it should look like a lasso, so just cut the circle. Now you should have one long string, which really comes in handy if you ever decide to become a mummy. Ah! So now, foot by foot, just stretch it out so that the string curls under. Now that you have your yarn, cut it to about a yard and then tie them all together and start your Scooby-Doo technique. Separate it into four groups and you can put the knot in your foot. To make it easier and keep all the groups together, you can tie them into a loose knot at the top. Okay, let's start. And if you ever get lost, just look at the diagram. So find the opposites and cross them over. Then, take the other two sides and make sure you go over one and under the other. Now take the other side and go over and then under. When you pull it tight, it should make a square. And if you feel uncomfortable holding it in your feet or it's hard, you can always just use a clipboard. Now once you have about six inches left, untie your loose knots and tie a big knot to end it. Now just cut the excess off and voila! You made a dog chew toy out of your old t-shirt. What do you think, Fluffy? I guess cats like them too. Sedona, did you finish cleaning out your closet? <sighs> yes, Mom, I did! Well guys, I gotta go finish cleaning out my closet. Wait, Ben, you wanna help me? I'm um, sorry, I can't. I have to go uh, feed my fish. Wait, wait! I have to tell them to like, comment, subscribe, and post on my Facebook and tweet me at Sedona the Iwan. Wait, you don't even have a fish.